Pregnant women were not part of the studies for the vaccine, although a small amount of participants did get pregnant during the trials. Still, a San Antonio doctor who is expecting her own child has confidence in the COVID-19 vaccine and received her first dose. Tonight, she told the night team's Tiffany Huertas why this vaccine means so much to her. As Dr. Nayeli Rodolfo Zayas received the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine, all she could think about was her mother. She died of COVID-19 in June. I thought of her a lot and it was kind of an emotional moment for me receiving it. For the last year, the emergency medicine physician has been treating COVID-19 patients. Being at risk of getting it every day, going into work, seeing COVID patients, having to take care of them, I do not want to catch this disease. Rodolfo Saez is also 34 weeks pregnant. She says before getting the vaccine, she did her research. The vaccine is an mRNA vaccine. It does not enter the nucleus of the cell or alter the DNA. So in theory, it should not cause any genetic abnormalities in the fetus. It's a conversation that I had with my provider and with my spouse and weighing the risks and benefits. And I think we made the right choice and I feel very healthy. My baby's very healthy so far. The only side effects she had was a little pain in her arm on the first day and she felt a little tired the following day. If you are pregnant and you get COVID, you can have a pulmonary embolism, which is a blood clot in the lung. You can get blood clots in your legs and you can have a miscarriage. Rodolfo Zayas says she looks forward to getting her second shot later this week. She says pregnant women should have a conversation with their doctor before getting the vaccine. Tiffany Huertas, KSAT 12 News.